What's up, everybody? It's Itsu Komodo, and I got my girl here with me, the gamer Gigi. We're back on Minecraft. Whoa, fall flat. That's what I'm talking about. Yada, yada. Whoop, getting those dollar dollars. <laughs> I guess. I don't know what we're getting, but we're getting into something today. Gigi, the gamer queen, why don't you tell them what we're doing? Yeet, yeet. Today, we're going to be doing a Christmas dojo build battle. Christmas dojo. I love it. I love it. All right. Uh, uh, looks like this is your side. Okay. I'll get over here now. Christmas dojo. So, uh, uh, you guys can see in my inventory, I've got some things to include dirt because I always have dirt. Hey, uh, I have some other things too, but that's because she's already told me what we're building today. But you guys don't know what we're building today. So Gigi, tell them, tell them what we're building. What are we doing this first round? Today we're going to be building a Christmas present. Present, a uh, present. We're uh, multiplayer, build all. First round is one present. All right, we got three rounds to do, I think, today. We only got two slots, so we'll have to take care of that too. But uh a present okay any rules about the present or anything like that there's no rules about the present except be creative and have fun be creative have fun i love it all right well let's get into it then um let me see this is gonna be interesting uh i gotta try something over here that i've never really tried in creative before and i don't know how it works i know kind of how it works in uh survival but i didn't quite know about creative um so let's see uh let me ask you what's your uh favorite gift that you ever got do you remember what that would be well i got an instax camera last christmas in you got instax camera what is a what is an Instax camera? You take a picture and it develops film, and you shake it, and a picture comes out. Oh, like a little Polaroid type camera. Yeah, you take a picture, like that. and then uh, okay, okay, that's that's pretty cool. Did you take some cool pictures with that? Yeah, on Christmas we did. <laughs> Christmas. It was bad because we had bad lighting because it was morning time. Oh. Uh, yeah, I guess uh, cameras, doing stuff with cameras can be a little tricky. It's a lot more to it than people realize. We get spoiled with all these nice, fancy phones with cameras and tablets with cameras and three different cameras on the one device and yada, yada, yada. Forget that there's a lot actually to the, you know, taking good quality pictures. Uh, so, hey, something to think about. But my present is coming along this is quite i feel like it's very tough to really be creative uh with the present it just seems so uh i could have did something different like maybe like you know if you had to wrap something like a bicycle or something that would be pretty tough so i could have pretended maybe that i was wrapping something i guess you could say oblong or abstract um that might would have been a little different Oh, and you actually can come up with an idea for that. What's in there? Let's see. Maybe we can. I don't know. Let's see how much time it takes us to get this done. Um, my plan to use the coral is n not working because it needs water. So I'm worried. I was thinking creative. It wouldn't matter. But I'm worried if I place this. Oh, so, okay. So I can at least do that. Cool. Oh, nope. <laughs> Ah, well, that's not cool. I want it to at least... You guys see what I'm going with there, though. Uh, I guess if you're in your own world, you want to figure out some kind of way to get water uh, up under there or something. I don't know how that works, that mechanic. We'll play with that a little bit. But that was, that was the idea. Other than that, I don't really understand how to make it any more jazzy than this. So we'll, we'll go with that. For a nice little bow, I guess. Let's see. What can you just do? I think I'm pretty much done with my present, but I'm gonna. I'm over here. I'm gonna play around. I was wanting to use coral, and 
seems as though you have to where is a where's the bucket am i am i missing it oh creative you're such the bane of my existence are you an item bucket of water is an item yes it is um okay so if you stick it there does it stay okay seems to be so far what about that does that work okay now let's see something else what if you put this here and this here nope that doesn't stay that must be need to be in water touching water um does it stay if you put it underneath don't know what about these fans uh he just comes <laughs> comes out straight gray get in the trick of the coral uh, it's a trick uh so if you do it oh i do know if you were to put it in here the fan it stays yeah it does it has to be placed in water okay um i wonder if this is the same way then dirt man to the rescue so put the water in and put the coral fan on dirt as long as it's in water is it good we'll see can you stack them nope you cannot <laughs> all right well there's that oh so okay so she's got multiple things going on over there Oh man, making me feel real, real simple over here with my one little gift. And I was wanting to do this. Like, does that not look like a present too? <laughs> you know, that does look pretty good. And I was going to uh, save that for a little bit later. Okay, we're not going to, we're not going to come out with that quite yet. All right, who's, who's we looking at first? We're looking at mine first. Uh, All right. I can already pretty much see what I got going on, which is not a lot. <gasps> All right. You're going to have to tell us about. Oh, look at this. This is like a little. T ah, I do like that. You did get a little more creative than I did. <laughs> tell us about it. So this is Santa Sacks with presents overblowing it because people are being really good. This Santa Sack. All right. And I'm just going to go ahead and break Santa Sack. And find all these other presents, and I don't care what you break. It's just a bunch of stuff in here, and ta-da, look at all these. <laughs> Whoa, okay, that's kind of cool. That is. And over here is a blue and pink present with a white bow. Pink, blue, white bow. I love it. And there's nothing inside right now. It's just hollow. And, oh wait, I know what Dirt Man would love. A bunch of dirt. Ah, uh, yep, there it is. Dirt Man with his dirt plans. Hey, why'd you do that? <laughs> oh, me. That's awesome. That's awesome. All right, hey, what's, uh, mine is just a green box. It's very simple. It's kind of like your pink present, but it's not even that cool because it's just a box. But I did try some things with coral over here and learned that coral has to be in water. The coral fans uh, have to be in water and a coral block can be beside water. So that's cool. What else are we getting into next? We are getting into a Christmas tree with some decorations tree with decorations huh yep. whoop 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 all right let's make that happen then all right so i think i've got some materials ready i'm gonna try a couple of different things out over here and this is gonna be aggravating and creative to do i don't know how to crouch or stay permanently crouched that's not that the only thing i can do to crouch is that i don't know what my butt other button is to crouch but how do you crouch when flying, you know? That's tough. That's aggravating. I was going to try to make a tree out of these composters, but it's so aggravating. <laughs> yeah, uh, but I think that's kind of cool. Actually, you know what? Wow. When people are making those palm trees, that actually right there is a the perfect thing to make a palm tree out of. Ah, so that beach idea you had, Gigi the Gamer, I think I might actually do that. And I might actually try this method here to make a tree trunk. Look at that. That's pretty cool. It looks like a palm tree to me. Or composters. Yeah. I, was I was debating whether to use barrels or those. But 
Uh, so not really great for a Christmas tree necessarily, but it's going to work today because I want it to. Um, and I had this idea. This is just not, it's not going to work well. And fences, there we go. Goodness. All right. Um, all right, you see that? To me, that looks very Christmas tree like. And I think it's unique. And it allows you to put your presents down, which are these things right here. Is there any Christmas tree traditions that you really enjoy uh, regarding putting up a Christmas tree in your house? Well, we usually watch movies while we do it. And it's very entertaining and fun to spend time with family. And all that stuff, watching all those Christmas movies. It's so fun. Whoa, yeah, that's kind of cool. You got, uh, what's about a favorite uh, Christmas movie? Tough, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. I yeah, like. I like Santa Claus too, I guess. Santa Claus too. Okay, that's a good one. That is a good one. Nice classic movie. I like something like maybe Home Alone. That's pretty good too. It's classic. All right, what'd you come up with over there? You done? Oh, wow. What? What's this little? This is a guy over here. That's super cool. This is Charlie Brown's famous Christmas tree. And <gasps> Charlie Brown. This is Charlie's little Christmas tree and a present. Look, you went above and beyond. This is this is much more creative than mine. I think it's wonderful. Thank you. And this is a sad surprise, sad present. Very sad. What's that? <laughs> the matches the mood very much. Yeah. Pigston. <laughs> What's Pigston, man? What was that about? I had a sad accident with a pig, so that's what happened. Oh, you took him out, huh? You took out Pigston. Oh, man. We got Zomboys coming out now, though. Zomboys and, uh, what, I forget what these, Phantoms. Yeah, Phantoms. But you're, you're, that's awesome. You did a wonderful job. Thank you uh, very much. And I guess my pork is gone. The pork is gone. Oh, <laughs> you put pork down in there. Uh, you you would have had to. You put it. Oh, okay. You did do two holes. Okay. Yeah. That's what I was gonna say. Oh man, that, that's so funny though. That's so funny. Oh me. Well, I just kind of did like a standard uh, thing over here. I did put a little fireplace for Santa Claus to come on down, but uh. I thought these amethyst things kind of looked like presents, so I kind of did that, and I made a interesting looking tree with a star that actually you have to turn on. So I thought it was kind of cool. All right, what we got? What we got? Today we got Santa. Today we got Santa, huh? Yeah, we, uh, we, of course we do. Today we got a present. Today we got a Christmas tree uh, with lights. And Charlie Brown Christmas tree, multiple presents, and a present sack. And now I got a carpet up under here. It's like a tree skirt. And I've added in some milk and some cookies for Santa when he comes down. And so now, finally, we have also Santa, right? Yes, the big guy. The big guy. Yep.
All right, I think I'm finally done over here. Me too. Want to come check mine out? Yeah. Okay. All right, here we go. Here's my guy. He's, <laughs> he looks more like uh, <laughs> some kind of little elf or something, to be honest. But <laughs> there he is, Santa, old Saint Nick. gold belt buckle that's something you got a little long nose on there <laughs> uh you got a crazy that's looking little hat guy. and his magic red sack which you know redstone is the magical block of the game so dun, 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 dun. i think it came out pretty cool and he got some some cool lapis blue eyes yeah so all right that's uh that's it for me now what about you and all your extras over here. Whoa. This is Rudolph, the Redness Reindeer. Awesome. He looks wonderful. Thank you very much. He really does. Over here is Sandy Claus. Santy, old Saint Nick. And yours actually looks like a Santa Claus more than mine. I forgot the beard, too. I just thought about that. I wonder if I can add a beard on my guy. Oh, goodness. I totally forgot. I did not notice. Yeah. I, ha I think I, I had... Uh, I messed up when I put, um, I see what I did now. I tried to put wool, uh, for, um, up underneath his, uh, for his coat. I tried to put wool there for his coat. That might help mine out tremendously. I tried to put it there to be like white fluffs. Now, actually, he's looking like Sandy. And that... Oh my goodness, goodness, goodness. Now I got a Santa Claus. Oh, it's so, <laughs> the white wool is the trick. I wonder if, I wonder if we can do a trick on your guy. I don't want to mess him up over here, but I wonder if, look, look, teams, look how we teams. It is. That's, that, that did it. Oh, <laughs> your Santa is so cool. He's Thanks. so cool. Thanks. That makes me feel good. This is raw gold for his belt. Yeah, that's wonderful. I like that. And there's a sign right here that says, I lost my sack. I lost my sack. Yeah. <laughs> there it is. Whoa, you got over there quick. How'd you do that? <laughs> I looked over here. You were here, and then I moved over here. By the time I turned around, you were... No, oh, you didn't do it that time. <laughs> it's been so fun. Yes, and this has been a great experience today with all these wonderful builds. Uh, your outfit. I'm finally getting a chance to see this grandma thing or whatever. What is that you're wearing? I am the Duke of Wesselton. No, that's so cool. That's so cool. Well, hey, guys, I hope you guys enjoy what we did today. And uh, it certainly was a grand experience for us. It was so much fun. So, hey, let's tell them bye. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye-bye.